we have having breakfast and we're at Yonderman's Cafe up in Derbyshire and today's plan is going to go to Castle to Norway mm -hmm. and we're going to go and visit a Speedwell Cavern and we're going to take you down the Speedwell Cavern. we booked tickets haven't we? Yeah. And it's underground so we'll uh, finish breakfast and then we'll take you a short run it's about 10 miles to Castleton from here. What do you think? It looks pretty good, doesn't it? It does look good. One of our favourite breakfast spots here, isn't it? I think it is, yeah. Yeah. And we're here on a weekday, Tuesday, because it's my birthday. Right, well, breakfast was a lovely, wasn't it? Very nice, yes. What worth did you think? For. Yeah, really good. As good as ever. Excellent. Seem to have extended the place, don't they? There's a lot more seating than they used to yeah, have. Yeah, loads of seating here now. Um, Bigger car job. park as well. Seen somebody drop a brand new GS on that uh, exit to Yonderman's. <laughs> Poor thing was spinning around on its cylinder head, wasn't it? That's in gear. In your mind. Well, folks, it's a, a stonking, a beautiful day. It's not a cloud day in the off, sky. It? It's nice to uh, to have great weather on your birthday. Mm. This one here, six oh four nine, Bradwell, Great Hooklow. Little Hooklow in Castleton. Oh, beautiful hair, Carol. Absolutely mm -hmm. beautiful. Lovely view Look at down that. there. What a stonking view, eh? Rocks on the road there. Yeah, I see him, see him. You're in proper Derbyshire Stonewall territory around here. It is, isn't it? Yeah, they're everywhere. And spots All spots cyclists. behind the cyclists. It's a double whammy, guys. Yeah. No. Ah, let's go to the front. Really? Yeah, yeah, definitely. right to the front. So nicely done. And they're all still stuck behind the side. <laughs> horse box, yeah. <laughs> and a horse box, yeah. <laughs> it's the thing I do love about bikes, you can you can Get through just traffic, a little can't bit. you? Where you just, <laughs> where you just blocked yeah, normally. Be a bit cheeky sometimes. You can really. be a bit cheeky, yeah. Mm. You can. It doesn't bother anybody because then people are miles away now. Look, they're back there. Mm. Gravel everywhere. Mm. This is not MT10 territory. <laughs> it's all GS territory sort of road, isn't it? It's a, it's a, it's a GS road, yeah. Mm. God, that's slippy. Whoa. I'm amazed where these huge lorries <laughs> get down these lanes. Mm. Left? Left. Towards Castleton. A6187. Got the bunting out. Mm. You know what that's for? It's your birthday, isn't it? For my birthday? Yeah, oh, it's your birthday, that's look. Nice of it's them, good of them, isn't it? it? Cool, if they've done that for me 59, what they're going to do when I'm 60? <laughs> <laughs> this is it. We're in uh, Castleton. We may pop back here for a coffee after we've been down the, the cavern. What do you reckon? Yeah, I could do. Normally Castleton is a right tourist trap at the weekend, isn't it? Normally Jammed we avoid it at the weekends, yeah, that's why we kind of thought as we've got a day off on a Tuesday we'll give it a go. Yeah. yeah. Lovely place. Mm, it is a lovely place. We need to go in and out the other side really, don't we? Mm -hmm. Which is our remember. 
really is a lovely place. Even the kids have come out of school. It's nice, yeah. It's nice on a Tuesday. It's yeah, so much better, it is. isn't it? You can even park yeah. down the road here a lot today. Yeah, you can even park here. Although I notice they've got parking machines yeah, I've got here. Yeah, parking meters all the way along. Yeah. Here, isn't it? It's okay. A cabin. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you, you, you know, you're right. You're right. I know you're following the sign. I'm not going to. No, the no, you, you're right. As usual. As usual. <laughs> It looks nothing from the top, but hopefully we can show you what's below. He is parked correctly. Oh, God, that's bumpy. Where do you want to go? Just I'll here. fancy here on the tarmac, to be honest. I think. Yeah, we'll stand up. Okay, guys, if you paid to go down the cabin, Parking here is free for motorbikes anyway. Apparently it's not very good if you're claustrophobic. How many steps down is it? 106 apparently. 106 steps down? Yeah. I don't suppose it's gear. going down, <laughs> it's coming back up. Yeah, yeah, going down's all right I think, although your yeah. knees, I'm not quite sure. Well, we'll find yeah. out, won't we? <laughs> I'm banging my head so you're going to be. This is bloody steep. It is. God, blimey. Yeah. Such a good idea for someone to sit on. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least you can pick your spot. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? <laughs> Private tour. Oh, that one. That one there. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Watch her. Watch me, Ed. It's a good job to give you an order, isn't it? Hey, we're electric powered. What we're travelling now is an 18th century leg bike. Started mining down here in 1771, stopped in 1791. Um, speed well itself didn't really make any money. Put about £14,000 into this place, got about three grand back now. Basically, they lost 11 grand during today. It's money about a million pounds, so obviously enough to cry about. It's up 70 metres, goes that way, about 50, and that way, about 40. Really big vein of lead, the biggest one that we actually found. Oh, I can see light. Yeah, There's light at the end of the tunnel. You see the uh, last holes there, look. Yeah. <laughs> the boat's coming by. There they go. Hello! There. Hello. Hello. Hi guys! Oh, yeah. Is that Mark? What's the tour gun from your boat? Yeah, yeah. Is it Mark? Yeah, yeah. Oh dear! I'm surprised they let you back, I mean, after the incident. Make sure you bring them all back this time. I'll try. I've got you on video, don't worry. <laughs> Hopefully nothing slips out. <laughs> I am in short. Anything that's blackboard related? No. We're not far from the cabin. Once we get over here, we're going to get off the boat. We're going to head to the cabin for a bit. Uh, you can take some photos, I'll tell you a little bit more about it, and then once we're done, well, once we're done, we'll get back on the boat and then head back. Okay. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Come in. Come in. Alright, so, we're going to do here, this is what the speed bump is what we're here to see. Travel half a mile through that tunnel, it's brought us into here. Uh, the miners, they originally broke into the cabin in 1776, and when they did that, they continued mining just through there. So that tunnel over there, the one with the farm gate, uh, is the farm canal. It gets that name for two reasons. One, because that's further than the other one. Uh, and two, is because that's what they say at the end of every shift. Fucking yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's about 250 meters. At the end there, you have the whirlpool. That's what's filling the canal water. Right. You've then got 16 miles of the cave systems. And through there, you can get to Peak Cavern. You can also get to Titan Cavern. Peak Cavern, it'll take you about three hours. Not too bad. Uh, but Titan, it's going to take you about 12. And what Titan is, it's the biggest cavern in the UK. It spans about 141.5 metres deep, so it's pretty big. Um, so, yeah, maybe through there, don't, don't go to time. Just go to the pub instead. <laughs> now, over the edge, just over that way, you've got the bottomless pit. 
Now that's actually where we pump water from into the canal. Right. It gets the name of the bottomless pit because well, it's bottomless, obviously. Hmm. That was a joke. Hmm. Its actual depth is close to about 11 metres deep. So. It's not really bottomless, is it? It's no. not even that deep, really, no. is it? No. <laughs> Maybe you've been drowning it. Yeah, I suppose you could, yeah. <laughs> From here all the way up to the surface, you've got another 150 metres worth of limestone, basalt and fluorospar. That means we're about 200 metres below the surface of the earth. You better go and rescue you. I'm going to rescue Somebody already dropped one down there. Are we all ready? <laughs> she was scared of doing it. <laughs> Terrified. Thank you very much for your time. All right. Cheers. See you. Thank you. Yeah. How many steps was the count? 106. I'm going to lie down after this girl. Holy crap. Ooh. That's a workout. God, it's hot up here. So bright out here. I can't hardly see. Yeah, it's like dazzling. There was arse need to clean. <laughs> Covered in cobwebs. Need to clean. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was really good though, wasn't it, Carol? It was good, yeah, really interesting. Right, so we are just going to go back down the road into Castleton. It's not worth putting the camera on just to roll down the road. It's no more than a half a mile and yeah, uh, find a cafe. we'll see if we find a cafe get a cup of coffee. get a coffee and then we'll take you back up here and we'll come back up that way up there It's like a castle thing up there, look, Carol. I have. Inspired, yeah. Too hot for coffee, isn't it? It is a bit of the moment. Yeah. yeah. We're at the uh, bull, aren't we? Yeah, the bull, yeah, it's nice to go, actually. Really good. Nobby's nuts. Ooh. That's it, that side, so we balance out, so we've got top layer. <laughs> I suppose it's the same side. A recipe for disaster, mm. isn't it? Yeah, it's a good spot here, actually. It is actually, yeah. It's You're not going to charge uh, parking your bike and uh, refreshments, and you can sit by your bike. Extensive menu in there, well, looks like Really? You could have a proper full meal if you want to. I don't think so after that breakfast no, idea. I don't think so. I think, uh, yeah, sparkling water and it'll be fine. Well, it was a nice stop, wasn't it, Carol? Lovely stop, yeah. Yeah, definitely come here again. Okay. And what's mm. that castle up there behind you then? Heverall Castle. And the plan is now to head up Winnett's Pass and uh, we're going to do a slow loop round to do our final stop at uh, Wet and Mill. But uh, we'll probably finish the video once we've uh, reached the top there because, oh, you've seen, you've seen Wet and Mill so many times. Yeah, plenty of outside seating, isn't there? Mm, loads, yeah. Yeah, it's a nice spot. Mm. Weird to think that we were like a hundred meters or whatever it was below this ground here mm. floating along in a boat <laughs> yeah it's just a bit of a weird thought isn't it
settled to a steady 33 degrees now. Mm. Well, it's the warmest day of the year this year, isn't it? about it, we need to pass. Mm -hmm. in towards Sparrow Pit. Oh, it's glorious, Carol. Absolutely glorious. Just feel like a proper day off, doesn't it? Mm. Petrol. Ah, yeah. Well spotted. I'm happy now. Found yes. a petrol station. Always happy when I've got a full tank. <laughs> oh, I've only got that crappy E10 there, though. Something else on the other one? Yeah, I don't matter. We'll use most of it on the way back. It's not going to sit in the bike long. It's not it? going to sit in the bike for long. Oh, you waited for the slowest car ever. I know, I'm sorry. To come by. Doing about sure 10, miles, right on, behind 10 you. miles an hour. A cone in the way. You get by that. Go. Cool. Street lights down. It's all right. Have to take every advantage when you go a motorbike. <laughs> oh dear. It just seems too cheeky to go up the inside. It's not cheeky. You wouldn't do it in a car. I wouldn't have done the car, you're right. There's another petrol station here, look. Go on. I'm passing a petrol station. Mm -hmm. I'm passing a petrol station. Right guys, we're on our way home. I hope you've enjoyed uh, coming along on uh, my little birthday treat. Uh, if the uh, cabin's turned out and we can see anything underground, <laughs> uh, you'll see it on this vid. If not, it's just been a ride to Castleton and up Winnets Pass. Thanks a lot for watching and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Bye-bye. There's a surprise, we're at Wet Mill again. <laughs> hey, so it's got a Willis Jeep. <laughs>